During the pandemic, Phineas' physical change and Chester' chemical change were required to stay at home. But their parents, Mr. and Mrs. Change, were unhappy about it. Enough of this pandemic. These boys are driving us crazy. And it was true. When Phineas' physical change and Chester' chemical change walked into a room, it was guaranteed things would not look the same. It looked like it was going to be a long and unpleasant days for their parents. Phineas just seemed like he was always grouchy. He would crumple papers, pour water on Perry the platypus's tail, rearrange the furniture all over the house, toss mud at his brother's bicycle, and tease his sister. Phineas' physical change had a funny habit. He never ate anything that was cooked. He liked to make a chocolate milk and raw egg white smoothie in the blender and drink it all day. Chester was a real trouble, though. He would only wear bright cl white clothes, so he would pour bleach in the washer when his mother wasn't looking and ruin everyone's clothes in the family. He didn't like to eat fresh food, but rather he preferred rotten bananas, blackened popcorn, hard-boiled eggs, mushy brown apples, and he insisted everything had to be cooked to a burnt crisp if he were going to eat it. The problem was they were always blaming each other whenever anything happened in the change household, and the bickering and arguing was driving their parents crazy. They had a little sister, though, and her name was Tabitha Telltale Change. Tabitha always knew which brother was responsible for the mess. Her parents had no idea how she always knew which boy did that. After a few days, Mr. and Mrs. Change begged their daughter to tell them her secret. Tabitha smiled and told them, Remember when I told on the boys and they were mad at me when we went camping last week? Chester threw my sandwich into the campfire and my sandwich turned into a black ashy mess. That sandwich was a goner. And then Phineas took my cookie and crumbled in his hand. But, I could still pick up the pieces of cookie and, at least, I had something to eat, but I could never eat my sandwich again. Her mom and dad looked at her in surprise. Of course, I get it. When Phineas Physical makes a mess, we can still tell what he started with. Only the physical properties such as size and shape of the original material are changed. And even when he gets his things wet and dirty, we can still clean them up and they will go back to their original states. That's right. Yesterday, the two boys wanted to cook. But Chester Chemical said that they should let the smoke alarm went off. After they were done cooking, I couldn't even tell what food they were trying to cook with. It was all black, hard and disgusting. Now I know what to look for. Gosh, Chester's messes seem to do a lot more damage than his brother. Looks like Chester's ideas are a lot more dangerous and could ruin things permanently. Chester's messes can sometimes be surprising like changing into some new color, or even glow. But worst of all, we can never quite tell what it was he started with. And it almost always stinks. Well, thank you Tabita. They felt relieved for the first time. 